Right, well the good news girls is that you're going to be on Preston FM. <laughs> this is a radio station in Preston. You can't actually pick it up in Blackpool on the, the radio. Oh. But you can. <laughs> oh, no. You can pick it up on, you can listen on the internet. Oh, and if anybody can't listen to it on the internet either, we'll uh, do a copy on a CD and bring them in and you can have a listen to it. Oh, so oh. what we're doing now is we're going to record uh, some bits and pieces and we'll chop it together, we'll edit it. So if you say something and it goes wrong, you don't have to worry about it. You say, oh, okay. So I'll cut it out, we'll make a nice little piece. Because what we're actually doing is we're doing a, a preview for the uh, Rats Britannia Festival in June. And uh, I want to find some local belly dancers to talk to, and here you are. <laughs> so, you get you so, <laughs> Let's get what you I'm going to do, I'm going to go along the line, I'm going to stick this in front of your face, don't worry. You, you just say, hello, I'm Jackie, or whatever you name. Know. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to be Jackie today, you can be whoever, whoever okay. you're calling. Okay. But you, we go along, you say, hello, I'm Jackie, hello, I'm so and so, I'm so and so, I'm so and so. And then once we've gone along the line, I'd like you all to say, and we're the whatever. Yeah. What? What? Sahara Sahari. Where's Sahara's Hari? You'll shout that out, and then we'll, we'll edit it together. It'll sound really good, and then I'll ask a few questions to different people. Okay. So stage names. Stage names. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Abby, you really should be first because you're the dream queen. Yeah. I don't mind. Look. <laughs> you're I, should, I should do a little preamble. <laughs> oh, what's <it's> the matter? <laughs> Well, I'm in seventh heaven just at the moment because I'm surrounded by a bevy of absolutely gorgeous belly dancers. <laughs> Let's find out who we all are. Hi, I'm Sahara and I'm the teacher. Hi, I'm Rafika. Hi, I'm Marika. Hi, I'm Phaedra. Hi, I'm Bellows. I'm Shazida. Hi, I'm Marla. Hi, I'm Nola. Hi, I'm Tala. And all together, oh. sorry. <laughs> All together, we're how about have a practice. We've said it a couple of times. One, two, three. We're the Harris Harry! Woo! I can do that one again. <laughs> so it's fine like that, it's just do it a couple of times and then we can pick the best bit. Costumes and the music and just the variety of people that come to belly dancing. It's for all shapes and sizes and it's loads of fun. Excellent. Uh, what do you like about it? I really like the exercise and I really like having a good laugh and getting totally away from a normal one. Excellent. All right. uh, is it easy? Yeah, it can be and it's very liberating. <laughs> After a lifetime of holding my tummy in, now I can let it all go and enjoy myself. <laughs> <Yay! laughs> Excellent. Uh, it's only women, there's no men, why is that? to do something really nice and get the troop going and we have a lovely time and we're good friends. Okay. And um, how long have you been dancing, belly dancing? Um, I started the day before my 16th birthday and Rax actually falls on my 18th birthday, which I'm quite excited about. Oh, excellent. So is everybody going to Rax then? Oh yes, yeah. We're all booked up. <laughs> One of us always knows the minute it comes on the internet and phones everyone else and then we book everything. Away. Very well organised then. So, so what is it? What is to, to explain it to somebody who hasn't got a clue? What is Rax Britannia? I think anybody would find it quite interesting. It's 
It's a group of ballet dancers from America, but they bring in ballet dancers from all around the world, the cream of ballet dancing, and they perform a show on the Saturday night on stage. There's a show on Friday night. Everyone gets together, we have drinks, you can have a meal, everyone gets the most flamboyant clothes on and just lets the hair down. And all through the day, there's also free shows. Anyone can put their name down. We're going to do a little performance on the Sunday. And there's also a massive are. There's all kinds of jewellery and clothing and it's all around the Empress Ballroom, all around the edge. So you just sort of soak up the atmosphere. It's just like a big mega belly dance fest. But I think anybody <laughs> could enjoy it who likes glittery clothes and jewellery and all sorts of tattoos. There's massage parlours. There's everything you could imagine. Excellent. So... Uh... <laughs> I've got a question, if, if I may. Can I borrow you a minute? Yeah, sure. <laughs> now, I see these two ladies are, are wearing long tops. Yes, they now, are. Now, I'm intrigued because I have got the most horrendous scar across my midriff. Um, I'd love to have a go, but I would be so embarrassed at frightening people with my scar. It's no problem at all. In belly dancing, you don't have to expose any part of your body you're not comfortable with. Oh, that is absolutely fantastic. You know, it's up to you how, what extreme you take it. I mean, especially in places like Egypt, yes. when the ladies don't even uncover their bellies. Yes. So it's really up to you. That's why I love belly dancing so much. It's individual. It's down to the individual in what clothing you wear, what music you dance to, what style you like. And it's really, it's one of the freest dances ever because you're just free to express yourself and, and do whatever you want. So that's why I love it. Fabulous. Thank you. And there's nothing rude or smutty about it? It's... No, certainly not. No, at all. <laughs> no, some people still have that prehistoric yeah. image of belly dancing that it's, you know, it's about seduction and it's stripping and it's, it's not like that at all. It's a cultural dance. It's, you know, thousands of years old. It's used for different reasons because of birth or people use it as, you know, to celebrate womanhood and for dances for women. It was, you know, originated as a dance for women because women lived segregated lives mm -hmm. where they, you know, they entertained each other through singing and dancing and poetry. So it's certainly got nothing to do with that side of it. That's the wrong impression. In fact, we have met you. We, we <laughs> went along to the Roma when it was, um, Mo's wife's birthday, and you were there, oh, yeah, and we that. remember oh, you. I, I, I love them. That was for yes. me. <laughs> they're, they're super, aren't they? I, I really enjoy it when I go there. And we couldn't stay. We were gutted because we we thought, oh, uh, we'd have had a chance to see you. Never next mind. Time. Catch up. Yes, definitely. Yeah, or you can catch me at the Med restaurant. As well. Oh, we've got um, <laughs> we've got a proposition to put to you because the, there. there's a. Right. So when do you dance at the Med? <coughs> Um, usually, um, once a month, they have a, um, a Greek night, and it's their party night, and that involves um, DJs, sometimes plate smashing, and always the heart <laughs> of the belly dancer. So that gives people, you know, they get a chance, it's my chance to show people what belly dancing is about. It's a skill, you know, it's, it's a great dance, it's not just, you know, not just anyone can do it. You've got to practice and you've got to you know, show that there's a skill involved. And then I get people up and I show them what to do and they have a little dance themselves. So it's just a great atmosphere and I really enjoy it. Right, excellent. And uh, so the, what, the show you're going to put on at Rax, your troupe, what's that going to be like? That's going to be fabulous. I really <laughs> can't wait. These girls have practiced so hard for that and we're even getting matching costumes wow. so we're going to look completely unified but yet still individual because that's what belly dancing is all about you know we've got all different shapes and sizes all different ages all coming together for a common a common cause which is our love of belly dancing so we're going to go out there and we're going to really enjoy it right so if people want to come and cheer you on at uh, Rax Britannia when can they come and see you well our open stage slot is at 3 45 uh, on the Sunday Okay. And you're also appearing at Out to Dance? Yeah, we are at Half One. We're not sure exactly where it is yet, so those are final details that need to be made. But we will be performing a 15 minute slot on the um, 23rd. Oh, we like to wow, I would love that. There you go. When is that? Chance to be a model. All you need to do is um, give us your name and your dress size. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
and a contact number so I can get in touch with you. Uh, and then come along on the evening and, and I will obviously give you a map of how to get there, etc. etc. One, two, three, go! Go on, sign up yeah, now. Right. Go on, oh, sign up now. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I think we should all do it. Yeah, I think we should all do it. Yeah, you're busy now. Well, no. yeah, let them, they're going to do a performance. She can do that in a minute. Okay. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I'm, I'm taking over now. I do apologise. We're <laughs> <laughs> so professional. Now, we do need boxing around quite a bit. <laughs> <laughs> so are you ready? Yeah. I'm not in it. This is nice, actually. Oh.